everybody, it's me, Megs, and today I'm going to be doing a hair tutorial. A few days ago, I had the honor of attending the barbershop, the Next Cut movie premiere with Cream of Nature. I had so much fun, and I want to send a big thank you to Cream of Nature for inviting me to the movie premiere. I had a great time. I also saw a couple of YouTube friends there. I also was in attendance with Miss Von TV, and we had such an amazing time. I actually got to see the movie as as well and Nicki Minaj's hairstyle in the movie kind of stood out to me and I was like you know what I'm gonna do that hair I'm gonna do a twist out to mimic the hairstyle that she had in the vid uh, the movie rather not video movie so the very first thing I did I washed and conditioned my hair I'm using cream of nature mango shea butter ultra moisturizing shampoo and it this stuff feels oh so good and I use the Cream of Nature Mango and Shea Butter Conditioner. Shea Butter is really good for moisturizing and Mango is great for uh, strengthening. So my hair feels really good. It's very moisturized and I do have a lot of new growth. So I definitely needed to use this to soften up the texture going on in my roots. <laughs> So I'm going to part my hair in half. I'm gonna be really gentle with this because I do have two textures going on. And my hair feels absolutely great. So I really love using the Cream of Nature products because it made my hair super manageable. So I'm gonna section off my hair with a clamp. And as you can see, I have two halves that I'm gonna be working with first. Like that, and my hair is air dry, but it's still a little damp as well. So that's why I'm taking my time with sectioning off my hair. So I'm gonna do a very small section um, from uh, the part down to my ear like that. And the parts don't have to be super perfect either. And like I said my, before, my hair is damp. So I'm gonna be really gentle when uh, manipulating in my hair. So I did section off the back half and I'm gonna use the Cream of Nature Mango and Shea Butter Ultra Moisturizing Leave-In Conditioner. And this has to be my favorite. Okay, it makes my hair so manageable. It feels like butter when it goes in my hair. My hair is so easy to detangle. It just feels wonderful and it smells great. So I'm gonna apply this in my section and definitely make sure I apply some in my roots where my new growth is. And just kind of take my time and make sure I distribute the product from roots to ends like that. And I'm gonna detangle gently with a rake comb um, from the bottom and working my way up to the roots like that. Now I'm gonna use the Cream of Nature Argan Oil. This says for natural hair, but I'm relaxed. It's Pudding Perfection Curl Enhancing Cream. I like using this kind of product when I do twist outs and braid outs because it helps hold my curls and define them as well from my twist out or braid out. But today we're doing a twist out. So I'm gonna apply that on my ends and work my way up to the roots. It's also really, really moisturizing because there's argan oil in this and it adds a great shine. But I'm, I'm gonna seal it in with some, you know, uh, avocado oil. This is a personal choice. You don't have to do this, but this is something that I just have to do all the time. <laughs> so that's just my personal preference to seal in everything like that. And I'm gonna make sure I apply it in my roots. Next, I'm gonna use the Cream of Nature with Argan Oil from Morocco, Perfect Edges. And this is a hair gel. I love this gel. It holds my, you know, new growth great, you know, because I'm so many weeks post, this is exactly what I need, a nice holding hair gel that doesn't flake. So I'm gonna start my flat twist. I sectioned off a little piece of my hair in a triangle shape, and then I sectioned off in two strands and then I'm just gonna gently twist my hair. So it's kind of like braiding, but except you're using a two strand, kind of like twist kind of thing. So just take your time. So as you twist, you pick up more hair, and as you twist, you twist around and pick up more hair as you go. And this style works really great when you have a lot of new growth or if you're a natural girl and you want to have, you know, more defined look, it works great. I love twist outs. Twist outs are my favorite. So I'm gonna take my time and do this. And if you notice any tangles, you just take a comb and gently comb through the area that looks a little like it's trying to get tangled. 
So I'm going to take my time in doing this because my hair is damp and I don't want to, you know, um, be too rough with my hair when it's damp like this. And the reason why I do twist outs on damp hair because once it dries in the morning, it's going to be super defined and curly. So I'm going to twist all the way down. Um, what you can do also is apply rollers to the ends of your hair. I can't sleep with rollers, but I would highly suggest that you put rollers on the end just to make the look look a little more finished. So now I'm going to work on the rest of my hair and the rest of my hair is getting a little uh, drier than the rest, but that's okay because you want to do this on damp hair. So I'm going to section off this side. In total, I'm going to have about six uh, sections of twists, so three on each side of my part. So again, I just went ahead and I added my leave-in, added the pudding, and sealed with avocado oil and proceeded to twist like this. That rhyme, twist like this. So in total I have six twists like that. And I'm gonna go to sleep and I'm gonna wake up and my hair is gonna be dry and ready to go. I love this style because it's low manipulation, especially when I have so much new growth as you can see. <laughs> I have a lot in there, a lot. <laughs> So that is that, so it's the next morning. And I'm just gonna unravel my twist very gently, like that. Well, now I am. <laughs> and I'm just gonna unravel them really gently. I don't want them to frizz too much, but since we use the Pudding by Cream of Nature, my hair didn't frizz. As you can see, the curls are really, really defined. And that's always a plus when we're doing twist outs. So just take your time when unraveling your twist and you have really defined curls and you're going to have to fluff these out because at first it's going to look a little crazy, but you just have to kind of mess with it. Use your fingers, don't use a comb and just make sure your parts are um, invisible. <laughs> you don't want your parts showing and just kind of play with it. It's a really fun and cute hairstyle, which is also great for the summer months coming up. And you just kind of fluff it and just work with it, you know, have a little fun. It's a very fun hairstyle. You can wear it down. And over the course of a few days, it'll get even looser and you can do a really cute, high, messy textured bun. I love this style. My hair came out so good with using these Cream of Nature products. I love it and it smells so good. My hair smelled amazing. So this look is great for, you know, to wear during the week or, you know, during the daytime. But if you're looking to kind of spice up your look, maybe for a nighttime look or you're just looking for some extra drama, you can always add clip-ins into this look to intensify and give a little bit more, you know, sass and drama. So I took some clip-ins that had some texture in it, braided them, and the hair was wet, so... The clip-ins came out with some texture. I let them dry overnight. And as you can see, it has some texture that matches the texture that I have in my hair. You just pop those bad boys in. You know, very quick and simple to do. And it's like, you know, quickly you get a whole new look. And you get the look that Nicki Minaj had in the movie. It's pretty much identical to what she wore in the movie. It's a really nice kind of effortless, wavy you know fun look great for the summertime you know and it's just so easy breezy to do i really really love this look i'm gonna be wearing this you know look during the summertime and i absolutely love the way my hair turned out so feel free to check out the description below if you want to see all the products that i use in this video and don't forget to check out barbershop the next cut which is in theaters right now. And let me know which hairstyles you guys like from the movie as well. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you guys later.